Thank you so much for joining me for this very special occasion that I've been, I realize, probably dreaming of for actually many years. <laughs> and uh, you probably noticed on your way here today a beautiful landscape and some maybe dark clouds rolling in and the beautiful Coast Salish Sea that we see out here. And we're very fortunate to be on the Lekwungen First Nations uh, traditional lands tonight. And I'm very thankful to be able to share parts of my soul and my journey uh, in this space and in this area with you. And if you look around this, this beautiful space right here and all the detail that went into this evening, so big gratitude. Um, yeah. This Regal Heart album release. Whoop, whoop. <laughs> It's interesting doing your first full-length album because it means that the songs that you've put on the album oftentimes aren't always very recent. So some of these songs I've been, I wrote quite a while ago. Um, but th that being said, all of the songs are really about the ebb and the flow and the, the, the highs and the lows of the storylines that grace all of our hearts and our souls and about the resiliency of the human spirit and the strength of the human heart. Yeah, and these songs are really about reaching into those rather rough yet beautiful places that are a catalyst for transformation and love, uh, both personally and globally. So thank you so much for being here. Um, to start off the evening, it's my pleasure to introduce uh, a young woman who's going to open up with a handful of songs for us. And I remember the first show I ever played, 2009, I was opening up for um, some folks in Nanaimo and how, what a big deal it was for me. And I was so nervous and I made the classic of mistake, it was a big learning, is that I played my heart out the night before in my living room, just rock, gave the best concert of my life and hardly had a voice left for the actual show. <laughs> so, um, but from that moment, I realized someday I wanna, I wanna be able to headline, but I also wanna create opportunities for other artists um, to open and to have opportunities that, to, to support creative expression. So, uh, Alexandra Berg, who I'm gonna invite up to the stage in a moment, um, she was a woman in song, a performer, as many of you know, women in song through UN Limited community, and also through the community at Gorgeous Coffee. Uh, Leslie over here runs Gorgeous Coffee, and it's such a beautiful community of musicians, and there's music going on there uh, every evening of the week, really. And so um, I'm always so blessed when she sends along, like, I have some great young female like vocalists and musicians to send your way for Women in Song. So this is where I met Alex, and she grew up uh, playing uh, in band in school and competing, playing flute, but at 16 decided she wanted to sing and find her voice and play guitar. So she has since been learning a lot of covers and um, finding her way in her, her own musical writing. So please give a warm welcome to Alexandra Berg. Mm -hmm. Hi, everyone. Thank you, Shauna. Can I get myself set up here? How's everyone doing? I have to ask that. <laughs> I'm super nervous. But I'm also very, very privileged um, to be here tonight. And um, I really have to thank you, Shauna, for, for, for choosing me for this, uh, for this special night. And, um, just to be able to celebrate the, the gift that you've given us tonight. I, I can't wait to listen to the full CD over and over again. Okay, so this first one is a cover. Um, it's one of my, my favorite songs by um, a Scottish artist named Passenger, and um, it's called Patient Love. <laughs> Go 
Got a pinch of tobacco in my pocket I'm not gonna roll it I'm not gonna smoke it till we're Staring at the stars and the rockets Twinkling in the silvery night Two sips of whiskey in the flask But I'm not gonna drink them I swear I'll make it last till we're Drinking out of the same glass again Sun may be washed by the sea, the old will be lost in the new, and four will not wait for three, but three never waited for two. Though you may not wait for me, I'll wait for you. picture in my wallet I'm not gonna tear it I'm not gonna spoil it it's an unspoken heartbreak a heartbroken handshake I take with me where I go three words on the tip of my tongue not to be spoken no song or whisper to anyone till I scream up at the top of my lungs again The sun may be washed by the sea, the old will be lost in the new, and four will not wait for three, but three never waited for two, though you may not wait for me, I'll wait for you. of tobacco in my pocket I'm not gonna roll it I'm not gonna smoke it till we're staring at the stars and the rockets twinkling in the silvery night Ooh, Thank you <laughs> This next one is um, is new for me, so be nice. Um, <laughs> uh, Sarah Bareilles has been one of my favorite artists for um, a few years, and she recently um, wrote a f her first um, Broadway musical, and I was I was so surprised when I I learned this, and uh, it's called Waitress, and so um, this song is called She Used to Be Mine, and it's just got such a beautiful story. And um, so I hope you like it too. It's not simple to say. Most days I don't recognize me in these shoes and this apron that place and its patrons have taken more than I gave them. It's not easy to know I'm not anything like I used to be, although it's true. I was never attention sweet center, but I still remember that girl. She's imperfect, but she tries. She is good, but she lies. She is hard on herself. She is broken and won't ask for help. She is messy, but she's kind. She is lonely. Most of the time she is all of this mixed up and baked in a beautiful pie. She is gone, but she used to be mine. It's 
It's not what I asked for Sometimes life Just slips in through a back door And carves out a person And makes you believe it's all true Now I've got you You're not what I asked for If I'm honest, I know I would give it all back She's bruised and gets used by a man who can't love. And then she'll get stuck and be scared of the life that's inside her, growing stronger each day, till it finally reminds her to fight just a little, to bring back the fire in her eyes that's been gone. It used to be mine. Used to be mine. She is messy, but she's kind. She is lonely. Most of the time she's all of this mixed up and baked in a beautiful pie. She's gone, but she used to be mine. Thanks, guys. You're too nice. Too nice on that one. <laughs> um, so writing is a difficult thing um, for any musician. I'm pretty sure there's a lot of musicians in the audience right now, and you probably know how that feels. So this is the one original I've managed to um, pull together <laughs> to be able to share with you all. So um, it was written about a, a best friend um, from childhood, and uh, it's called Goodbye Love. Goodbye, love. Goodbye. 
now it's goodbye love goodbye nervous now. Thanks, guys. <laughs> All right. Uh, and I'm not going to introduce this one because everyone's going to know it. And please feel free to sing along because I know there's a lot of people who are going to want to.
there's a God above and all I ever learned from love was how to shoot somebody who outdrew you. But it's not a cry you can hear at night. It's not somebody who's seen the light. It's a cold and it's a broken heart. Thank you again so much. Thank you, Jason. Thank you, Sunset Labs. And thank you, Shauna. We're looking forward to it. Alex, I'm sure you were beautiful at the flute, but I'm actually really glad you started singing. <laughs> Would you agree? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Exquisite voice. Yes, thank you so much. So I'm unveiling a little surprise this evening, and uh, the time is now. Um, <laughs> So about five weeks ago, so I'd finished the art part, right? I've got this album, my art is done. So then it's the business part of it. Um, I'm marketing and promoting, and how do, I, how do I do this album justice? How do I get it out in the world? And, ooh, you know, self-promotion, pushing edges for me. <laughs> and um, so I approached Jason, and Jason was like, yeah, let's sit down and just talk about some marketing and promotion. So I'm thinking, like, We'll sit down for an hour or two. I'll get some ideas. And uh, <laughs> five hours later, I'm like, <laughs> we need to stop. I'm so saturated. <laughs> I can't have any more action items. <laughs> um, <laughs> but uh, beautiful in that uh, one thing that kept coming up for me is like, oh, you know, if only I had a music video. If only I had a music video. It's something I've wanted to do for so long. And of course, any of you who know Jason, which many of you do, you say something like that, and an hour later, he's got someone on the phone, and I'm like, and it's in process. And um, this, this beautiful kind of collision of extroverted entrepreneur with introverted artist, <laughs> right? And something beautiful comes out of it, um, along with uh, a good dose of stress and overwhelm on the introverted side. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I'm so thankful for, um, for you, Jason, and for all the help that you've, you've committed and dedicated to um, making this happen. And so I'm not going to say anything else, but I would like to welcome you. Um, we're going to debut my very first ever music video. Yeah. Should I, should I move this? Okay. Um, it's called... Light and stardust, so enjoy.
back to my roots again Fire and water Thank you to Andrew Dodd Clippingdale at the back there. He's in the booth here of Dodd's Eye Media. Yeah, beautiful videography. And uh, Chris Smith, who is in, isn't here tonight, but he got that really cool drone shot at the end that lifted up. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, very fun. And again, for Jason for helping coordinate all that. It was uh, really fun. That was in Picoles, um, as uh, we've known as Mount Doug Park. And uh, yeah, just that's where the photography for my album was taken. That's where the video was taken. Um, those of you who have seen a lot of the photography around, that's from Brody Frey, like photography. So a lot of a lot of help going into this. So we are going to have like a ten minute intermission. Um, please uh, have more drinks or have some of the lovely ch um, chocolates that Daisy from um, Chocolate Fairy is here, and she's made. They're delicious. And we'll come back in about 10 minutes and I will play you some songs. Yeah. yeah. I like, I just have to sit here and smile. <laughs> People start to hush. <laughs> Hi, friends in the back. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, 
the way from the east you came like the sun rise sharing your rays rolling in like you own this place i'd never seen your face before my vacancy sign may be lit up on fire but it's not an invitation to fulfill your desires with me at least not tonight The fresh air is what they call me new But I see in your eyes the loneliness that lies on the inside On the So give it to me straight, you can stop the chivalry, no need to worry there, honey, cause I've got what you need, at least for tonight. Tall tales come crashing down, flooded by the howling sounds of dirty deeds and days gone past, it's no wonder you didn't last. Give you that. So offer me a drink and let's count the down and out. No, the ships that have sunk in the sky for second time. A breath of fresh air is what they're calling you. So give it to me straight, you can stop the chivalry, no need to worry there, honey, cause I've got what you need, at least for tonight. So share your story, line by line, cause I've got nowhere else to be but here in time. Yeah, thank you. So I have some special guests this evening. Um, one that you'll see up here almost as a permanent fixture is Martin Matichuk on the cello here. And then being really nimble, but don't pay attention as he tries to get up on stage, <laughs> is uh, Phil Hamlin. And uh, I actually just met Phil in person yesterday for sound check. <laughs> nice to meet you, Phil. <laughs> um, so while recording my album, which I'll talk a, a bit more about later for sure, um, I wanted some trumpet sounds. And through good old Facebook call out, um, I was so fortunate to come across Phil, who at the time lived in Duncan. And it's amazing what you can do nowadays. Uh, just send him the tracks, and he listens to it in his own home studio, adds the sounds. <laughs> uh, had me record Mouth Trumpet to get the ideas to him. That track will never be heard. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe a blooper someday. But it, it translated. It sure did. More on his part. <laughs> um, tremendous trumpet trumpet player. Tonight it will actually be the flugelhorn. Can you, t can you tell us a little bit about the flugelhorn?
Cool. And um, you play in a few big bands, Love Coast and Dope Soda. Yes? Great. So, thank you, Phil, for being here. This is <laughs> it is a pleasure. This song is called Not Your Hero. And uh, we all have them, those patterns in our lives or things that maybe limit us in any way, shape, or form, limit us from becoming a fuller expression of ourselves. Um, it may be limiting beliefs, mm. ways of showing up in the world that maybe self-sabotage is a bit too, uh, no, no, that can happen. <laughs> <laughs> um, so this is called Not Your Hero, and it's about those times when you know, you're working hard to let go of something that no longer serves you, and, and in the process of doing that, it is kind of dying a certain death to be able to step into something new.
Next time he comes up, he'll do a backflip off the stage there. <laughs> We've been practicing that. Isn't that a lovely sound? Yeah. yeah. So this next song is called Heart and Soul. And um, as many of you know, uh, my music is very much informed and vice versa by the work I do in the world, um, supporting others, providing support and education, and facilitating programs and community opportunities for navigating grief, navigating tough times in life, difficult times. I really believe that, as many of you in this room know, because you're also doing similar, very important work, um, that we, yeah, we live in a society right now that doesn't give us a much space or understanding around um, what it's like to help each other through pain and what a beautiful place of actual connection and resilience and strength that we can draw from that. And so this song um, is, is about marking those times in our life. If there's one thing that um, I know that I'm missing and many of us, you know, have been vocalizing is that we don't have a lot of markers in our life to celebrate how we walk through this world and how we change through time and how we carry our hearts and our minds differently and how we relate to the world and to ourselves as, as we age. And um, the song is about that, heart and soul. Uh, in, in this story, it's following a, a woman through early, middle, and late life and the importance of marking those and also the importance of the nature and honoring those who came before us. You're ready? days you're gonna find your feet with roots in the ground you're gonna learn to run free cause all you know is what you've been told and all you see is what you hope Memories passed on, you can 
sit back and smile Cause all we know Is what you show To the world And all you showed Was how to live A life Of heart and soul Of heart and Thank you. All right, so we're going to invite two guests, Phil again and Roy Pfeiffer on the piano. Um, here. So I often use, um, actually not as often anymore, but the songs that I will be writing next. I'm already there. I'm like, oh, I get to write new songs now. Um, I often use alternate tunings, which means changing the string tunings of different strings. Mm -hmm. um, I find it creative. And especially because I didn't grow up in music. Um, I came into music f in my late mid-20s, I guess, and don't know a lot of music theory and honestly don't have the patience for it. <laughs> This isn't, patience isn't my strong suit, quite honestly. Um, and so I have a very intuitive kind of process to writing songs. And I found alternate tunings to be really liberating um, because I could make any shapes I wanted to and just go by ear. So I'm going to pull a song out of totally left field tonight because as a singer-songwriter, I know it's like super rare to write about relationships. <laughs> Especially breakups. So I'm just going to, you know, throw one in there for you. This one's called Gambling Woman. Gambling woman, move as fast as you can Cause the dice they are rolling And it's your life they're pushing For as much as you try There is no escape from the night Your tongue is tied And all bets are off this time Gambling woman, what have you done? Don't you see all the smoke and mirrors? You can throw down your guns, for the ace of hearts has been laid. No need to cry in shame, cause we've all got our vices, and the story's to our names. Don't just see, your love's not for me.
coming It's time to say goodnight Cause your game is long over Was it worth the fight? For as much as you try There is no escape from tonight Your hands are tied And all bets are now in mine Don't You know You went for the broke Gambling woman, don't you see your love is not meant for me? Your love is not meant for me. Rory on the keys. This is fun. <laughs> Can we do this tomorrow? Okay. This is L. He came from Nanaimo to do my sound. Yeah. Yeah. This is about those times where we can feel a little lost in life. And um, I don't know about you, but sometimes when I'm in pain and I'm feeling lost, I start getting a little bit graspy for the things outside of me that I think might bring me some comfort, healthy or unhealthy. And... Uh, Realizing that, yeah, to, that the answers and home is always, it's, it's always with us, it's always in us. It's in our hearts, it's in each other's hearts. It's called Lo and Behold. Things are what they 
seem and you know they are Cause you got this far It's not set in stone The path is traveled it will save your soul And you know it won't Cause you've walked that road from the place that you thought was home and all that you know is you can trust your heart when the world around you seems to fall apart and through the years and a handful of sins you finally realize that home it lies within so when the winds catch you rolling like a stone Far from the place that you thought was home Just look within and you will see Cool. So there's always a lot of thank yous to be had. And right now, I want to um, pay a special and, and um, gratitude for the very talented um, person who recorded and helped me produce and mix my album, uh, Jay Waddell, sitting right here. <laughs> Wave. Yeah. of your soundscape studio. And um, yeah, it's been a pleasure. And um, yeah, if you want to record music, get a hold of Jay. It's fun, it's great, and uh, they're pretty brilliant. Thank you, Jay. So I'm gonna bring out a tragedy. <laughs> Is that all right? <laughs> You're like, really? Um, yeah, really. <laughs> This is called All the King's Men. This is one of my favorite songs in the album because Jay and I got to really um, add a lot of fun production elements. Most of my album is pretty much what you're hearing tonight is on the album. Um, oftentimes, it's just Martin and I playing, and I wanted to make sure that the album still had a very acoustic feel to it so that if you saw us live, you didn't get the album and it sound totally different, um, like a full band kind of thing. So um, it's very tasteful and, ac and acoustic-y. But this one song, I feel like... This song somehow reaches parts of my soul um, deeper than some of the other ones. And yeah, we'll leave it at that. This is a song, it's a based on a fairy tale. It, it actually was inspired, I was thinking about the, um, well, maybe I shouldn't say this because you'll probably have this imagery in your head while I'm singing it, but it's too late now. Um, Humpty Dumpty sat on the wall and then he had a great fall. And then this imagery started coming together and so this song was born. Um, and it's just about, you know, we live in, a inter in really interesting times right now. There's brilliant things happening and there's really painful things happening. And it can be really easy to want to kind of guard our hearts. And especially when it comes to love. And this is a story about someone finally opening up to love after being guarded. And, um, and it's glorious. And then they get their heart broken. And most people think that's the tragedy. But for me, the tragedy actually lies in um, whether or not we can then open up our hearts again to love again. Um, love and heartbreak are really two sides of the same coin, and it takes a lot of courage to keep our hearts open after those times.
sure I'm in tune. There's one worse thing than stopping two seconds in is listening to a whole song that's out of tune. <laughs> Take two, just like the video. <laughs> <laughs> but I didn't pause like, you know? Well, I just did actually, okay. Anyways, moving on. your fortress you batten the doors no one would dare even think to come close the heir to your throne a cold lonely heart vowed never to be broken to never feel hurt and all the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't persuade you to let love in persuade you to let love in. Oh my god, you know what I forgot to do? Retune my bloody guitar. That's why. I'm so sorry. We are actually going to really retune this time. I'm in the wrong. I'm still in alternate tuning. Oh, that took me a while. And comic relief, where are you? Thank you! Scheiße! That's German! No, we're not streaming live to the world! Hi, everyone! Oh. You're supposed to blame it on the bass player. Uh, yeah, I was like, something. <laughs> oh, and I'm, yeah, I'm just all over the place. Okay. So I'd also like to thank <laughs> Jessica, who's been at my merch table this evening, my, one of my bestest friends. <laughs> whoop, whoop, whoop. And also a very special person, Joni McCory. She has been to every woman in song. She is helping out all the time and so giving. She's amazing. Where are you, Joni? Thank you, Joni. You're right in front of me. Now I'm like extra like, is this really in tune? All right, we are. The show must go on. the doors no one would dare even think to come close the heir to your throne a cold lonely heart that never to be broken to never feel hurt and all the king's horses and all the king's men couldn't persuade you to let love in and all the king's horses and all the king's men persuade you to let love in and then came a day a battle too big to protect your lonely fortress your precious heart's key and all the walls fell through tears of salt as your ribcage burst open with of
taste and the love that you finally let in And all the king's horses and all the king's men Rejoiced in the love that you finally let in tight your new treasure adored when the unspeakable happened and your kingdom it tore and the heir to your throne in one foul swoop left your heart cold and lonely shattered in two Thank you, Rory. That was amazing. He'll be back in a little while. How's everyone doing? Great. <clears throat> you can never be too careful. See if you recognize this one. I took a little bit of artistic license on it. Baby, 
baby, baby, yeah. And I said, baby, 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 yeah. Can't you see? Thank you. This is cool, hey? <laughs> How's everyone? Yeah. So some songs take work. Others you're lucky enough to capture from the ethos around you. This is one of those songs that came. It was very meaningful to me at the time when it came. It still is. It's called Echo.
to the stars. Thank you. So I'm going to call up um, Rory again for our next song. Yeah, that's you. So I met Rory maybe five weeks ago? Yeah, we've been practicing. Um, and so, a couple, oh, last summer actually, um, I was playing at a market and um, an individual named Chris came up to me and he's a, a fairly active activist in our community and um, he enjoyed my music and, and asked, hey, do you ever write songs for people? Yeah, no, no I don't, <laughs> but I'm open. <laughs> um, he's like, well, we need a revolution song. Oh, no, small order. Um, would you be open to like, I was like, yeah, let's meet, let's, what are your ideas? Um, his ideas were many, um, but I know what is important for me when it comes to activism in our world. And, and there'll be of no surprise that an important part of activism, I strongly believe, is being able to feel our grief for the world, feel our pain for the things that aren't going the way we wished and hoped for when we were born into this world. And there's a lot of injustices and oppression and destruction of uh, our environment. And um, Joanna Macy is um, an environmental activist and a lot of her ideas are around we need to express gratitude um, but we also need to s be with each other and heal through our pain for the world and express our pain for the world if we're going to come out with new eyes and be energized to do the important work that needs to be done. And so this song called Rise Up is what was born out of those conversations. And um, at the end, I sing, I say rise up quite a few times, and I would love if you would join me. Are you, are you up for that? Yeah. Okay. Destruction of our forests, rivers and streams Carve away at our soul, a grief so deep We must not go blind, forget or go numb For what we do to earth is what we do to us To feel this despair is to be fully alive To dead arise up in our will Survive. A revolution is needed, and it starts within us. To find 
fight for the lives of generations to come. With grief in our hearts and rage in our bones, rise up, rise up. We must defend our home. Resistance is power, and the power is in us to protect Mother Earth. Destruction of our forests, rivers and streams Carve away at our soul, a grief so deep We must not go blind, forget or go numb For what we do to earth is what we do to our eyes With grief in our hearts and rage in our bones Rise up, rise up, we must defend our home Resistance is power, and the power is in us to protect Mother Earth and realize we are one. We will not succumb, not without dignity, standing for what is just and right in our communities. Cause love is our courage, it fuels our fight, and we will rise strong in the name of life with grief in our hearts and rage in our bones rise up rise up we must defend our home resistance is power and the power is in us to protect mother earth and realize we are one rise up rise up it's time to act in the name Thank you. So we've got two more songs for you this evening. Thank you so much for coming out and being a part of this special evening. Um, this is really memorable for me. Yeah. Thank everyone for helping to make this happen. Um, thank you, Jason, for hosting and helping to set up this beautiful, beautiful space. Um, thank you, Andrew, up there. Thank you, Al, for doing sound, and Joni and Jessica again, and Daisy, and for all of you. So the song's called Redwood. Uh, I had the pleasure of being nominated Song of the Year at the 2015 Vancouver Island Music Awards. Um, yeah, which was just an amazing um, accolade, an amazing acknowledgement. And this is a, a song that uh, I was traveling up the West Coast with someone that was very special uh, to me at the time. And he'd never really been on the West Coast before, let alone seen or driven. Uh, and so we're driving from San Francisco up into um, the Redwoods and on our way back and I was a little bit disappointed because it was winter time it was getting dark really fast and so we had long driving days but we couldn't really see all the scenery 
And, uh, but the gem of the story is that as we were on our way up to Garberville, anyone know those like really sharp switchbacks that are, go from the 101 to Garberville? So it's, it's like hairpins, but it's in this beautiful redwood forest. And uh, it was just magnificent. It was a really clear night. And so we got to the top and we shut off the lights and we were in this grove of redwoods and it's opening and we looked up and there was just a canopy of stars above us. And it was just so magical. So this song is about that moment and about um, two hearts letting go from a long distance relationship. Thank you again. Martin Matichuk on cello bass. <laughs> Martin and I have been playing for about a year now and I am so honored and so privileged to have you playing with me. So thank you, Martin. Thank you. And thank you, Rory. Five weeks. And he's just here playing it like, yeah, no problem. to pretend that we are just two lost souls separated by lifetimes and centuries old reliving our story when two hearts collide despite the great odds across ocean land and time Between distance and 
and space The magic of union and the longing for embrace This is our world between east and west Thank you. Thank you to Roy Pfeiffer on the piano. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you shouldn't. <laughs> so I have one final song for you. You've actually already heard it because it was the music video song. Um, do you mind hearing it again live? Is that all right? Do it. So thank you again to Alexandra Berg. Another hand for her and her exquisite, exquisite voice. <laughs> Feel free to hang around afterwards if you'd like to. Come say hi. I, I hear that I have access to uh, silver pens for signing. You know, because people carry silver beautiful pens around in their purse all the time. This is another song that uh, I feel fortunate to have, I guess, downloaded or captured in the ethos. And as you heard, it's, um, it's kind of a clarion call for our connectivity with everyone and to all things in the more than human world. Beyond 
Herself as she goes and borders one strong lies a vastness called Earth, a community of one. And all living things are kin, our blood. This is who we are, and we are, we are love. Joined by light and stardust to listen to the rhythm for everything it speaks. I am you and you. Thank you so much. I like giving hugs, so if you want a hug, you know, you know where to find me, I'm in the red dress.